on YouTube, T Dog here uh, with another quick video, quick ish. Uh, <laughs> per request of a subscriber, a, a video to wash and maybe explain how to wash my bike. It is a nice day. So, yeah, it's a nice day for to wash the bike, so why not? Also, this is like the last weekend before I go on my uh, vacation, so this will probably be the last video that I upload before I go on vacation, which is uh, this Friday, the 18th of May. Let me uh, explain a few things before I start. Alright, so probably the most tried and true form of washing a bike or car or anything like that is called the two bucket method, where you have a bucket of soap and a bucket of water. So I'm not gonna do that. Uh, I got right here uh, an attachment for the hose where it's a water spout with different kind of you know settings and stuff, but it also has a container that you put that you put your soap in. When you turn that on, the water and the soap mixes in it before it shoots out. I'm just gonna use this to rinse down the bike, then turn it on for the soap, and then wipe down what I soaked with a microfiber towel, something like this, to clean you know to, to wipe it down, clean it off and then turn it off and rinse it off and then use another microfiber towel to dry it off. And what I'm using to clean, uh, a friend of mine, he's a dealer, you know, brand for detailing and stuff. The last time I washed the bike, I used a special cleaner. I think I'm gonna use this wash and wax this time. I haven't used it yet. He gave me some other products too, but they're not really necessary for this process. But yeah, so here I go. Try to wash your car, or in this case, your bike, not in direct sunlight. Like right now, it's uh, about six. It's about six o'clock in the evening. The sun's mostly gone away. It's, it's definitely uh, beyond the horizon and all that right now. So there's no sun beating down on, on the bike on me. It's not hot because if the sun's out, then it'll cause you know water to dry prematurely, and it'll cause mar uh, water marks and all that stuff. Plus, it's hot. I mean, come on rinse her down real quick and wipe her down and should be pretty much done. So I, I guess I forgot to mention this earlier too, but I highly suggest using nothing other than microfiber towels or sponges. Microfiber, you know, anything, as long as it's microfiber. It, uh, don't, don't use normal, like, sponges and, like, shop rags. That stuff could scratch your paint. Uh, my bike's wrapped, so I really don't necessarily have to worry about that, but still, it's a good practice. <laughs> It. Uh, I do have a few little things I have to do with for it. Uh, like, I got some leather conditioner that I need to wipe the seat down with. Uh, there's a few spots I still need to dry. I like the wheels. Um, 
And also, don't forget the Vulcan S and any other bike specifically that's run by chain drive. After you wash it, make sure you clean and uh, lube the chain as well, which I'm gonna do you know, after all this is said and done. But yeah, other than just a few little things like grinding this and that and whatnot, uh, it's done. That's pretty much it. Uh, there's no need to wax or anything, or at least for me specifically. That, uh, that cleaner was a wash and wax, and it's not paint, it's final wrap, so I don't really need to. Uh, in, in the near future, I'm gonna have to like adjust the chain. I just don't have time right now. I'm probably gonna ride a few times this week before I leave out on my on my vacation, so it's not gonna be a big deal until I come back. That's the video, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, comment, share if you want to, and uh, I'll catch y'all next one. Peace. Oh, and also, uh, I guess just for a heads up, I do have a few uh, videos here and there uh, lined up to post while I'm gone. So, you know, that's something for y'all to watch while I'm gone. And I will be taking my cameras and stuff to New Zealand to, you know, vlog all that stuff and hopefully maybe get a motorcycle, like rent one maybe, to do a motor vlog there. At least one. I don't know. That'd be cool, right? So, alright, y'all stay safe.